Gotta watch Daddy Pig make love to that salad, apparently. Another cucumber? Daddy Pig, you're insane. <laughs> what the? I think, I think my character, I'm not touching anything. He's just, he's just having a stroke on the hill. <laughs> anyway, pen, because it's, it's tilted. No. Oh, wait, you can jump? Aw, oh, yeah. Whee! Okay. Fun time is over. Back to achievements. Do you know right. how to ski? <laughs> Miss Rabbit will it's, give us skis to go down it, the mountain. Ooh, a snowman! I love snowmen. We should build one gamer ourselves. score. Never want Probably. To build a snowman. You will find all the parts you need in the snow. Okay, I almost thought it was that easy. Okay, that's... This is a little... No, no, not yet. What? I was trying to move the small one to the big one. <laughs> I... Does that... I think that means I'm now dumber than a kid's game. Oh, a carrot. A carrot just in the... Sure, why not? Follow me. No, follow me. I almost thought it was going to be as easy as clicking A on the snowman. <laughs> Alright. Carrot. Oh, and there's like pebbles all the way over. Oh, so much running. <laughs> on second thought, I wish it was just as easy. <laughs> this is still ludicrously easy for 80 gamer score. Oh my god, I accidentally overran it. Because I was looking at the delayed screen, because that's where chat is. Follow me. Yeah, I, got, I, gotta, I gotta tweak my setup for next time. I mean, it's functional right now, but yeah. Could definitely use some improvement. This is the best snowman The other ever. snowman looked better. We did it. <laughs> You're just a narcissist, Yay. Pepper. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's something from the beach. Maybe it's like... Because you like met your parents at the sandy version of the beach. So maybe that's like you go from there. I'm surprised they don't do anything like random for the roads. It's just kind of like, you know, a little boring thing to make you drive. Alright, drive the... Wait, what happened? Hello, oh my Mr. gosh, they actually do do random things. <laughs> Hello, I ironically had just complained Hello, about children. that the last time. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. It's actually pretty funny. It's like the game heard me. It's like, oh, what's that? You want me to inconvenience you? Dangerous to drive through. Not to worry. Mr. Rhinoceros and I will take care of it. We'll let you get on with it. Is there a way to go through? Oh, yes. You can drive right by the road. <laughs> you can drive off road. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> Goodbye, Mr. Bull. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. Thank you for fixing the road. the whole other road. Apparently. So this probably takes me to Windy Castle, and then probably something from Windy Castle takes me to Potato City. I'd assume, anyway. Oh! Hello, Mr. I regret What's saying the thing where I'm just like, oh, like it just lets me drive Hello, through, how children. boring. We because, you know, if instead it's just going to be the same cutscene of them, like, jabbing the road, it's the exact same cutscene, too. Mr. Rhinoceros and I just have a problem just facing public property and destroying roads. We'd better be on our way. Hmm. Is there a way to go through? Oh, yes! You can drive right by the road. 
Be careful. Oh, I see. Thank you. Goodbye, Mr. Bull. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. It's like the same five rocks just jiggling back and forth. All right, please, for the love of Pete, be Windy Castle. to talk to the parents or grandparents or oh what's this ah there you are peppa we're taking you and your friends to windy castle windy castle has a very tall tower we'll get a view of the whole town you'll see all right all right all i had to do is walk inside <laughs> no George, i'm afraid there are no dinosaurs i'm a genius dinosaur but you can take mr dinosaur with you all right then why don't you two go and wait for us in the car while we finish getting ready yes daddy we'll go there right away but what if i wanted to go back to play group let's go to the car daddy will drive us to windy castle yeah thanks i i, I piece that together peppa <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> What's it's a good thing I don't have a wire control here. <laughs> I'd like Hello, I'd choke children. myself. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. What happened to the old road? <laughs> what happened to the road? I'm starting to think that there's nothing wrong with these roads. And you're not just trying to charge us taxpayers more money. I don't even think anything else other than the tree roots. We'd better be on our way. Hmm. You feel Is like you're going to go encounter this more than two times oh, in a row. Oh, yes! You can drive right by the road. <laughs> be careful! Oh, I see! Thank you. Goodbye, Mr. Bull! Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros! <laughs> Thank you for fixing the road! Goodbye! Oh, and I still have to drive to Potato City, which means I could run into that one more time. Or, I don't know if I have to, I don't know how you get to Potato City. Let's be honest. I don't know anything in this game. These, like, last couple achievements have been cryptic. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Yeah, I'll try going upstairs in the house and see if that somehow works. Favorite arcade Xbox games? I loved Comic Jumper. That was one that's always kind of stood out to me. Torchlight was another pretty good one. What else? It's hard to think because, yeah, like, Xbox Arcade was a while ago. Pepper's house. I mean, Portal's always, you know, that's a classic one. But yeah. God. I've played, like, so many games that it's <laughs> kind of blends together. <laughs> I'm sure if I had, like, more time to think about it, like, I'd, I'd like run across a game and be like, oh yeah, I love that game. Oh my god, was going upstairs to work? Peppa, you and your friend have been very busy. Oh my god, going upstairs to work. You've been helping people around oh yeah, pretty much all the yes, arcade games still work. I see. Well, they also have so like their own individual you, sales. And because you've been so good, we've decided to But yeah, they all work as Potato City. I mean the Xbox 360 still has multiplayer. Like you can Potato go on City, and play multiplayer on come. 
any game Daddy that still supports it. Get a bit dizzy last time you got on the potato rocket? Yes. Fusion sure. Frenzy, yes, I love yeah, that I'm game. Sure it won't happen this time. <laughs> Playing Peggle too? Yeah. You never learn. I, oh man, potato I loved Peggle and I loved place. Fusion Frenzy. Full of exciting things. Mr. Potato himself. Marble Blast. I played that a little bit. I need to play that more. Go to the car when you're ready and we'll be on our way. Oh, thank God. I'm finally going to get to Potato City. <laughs> I can finally be complete this game. Okay, please. Please, no Mr. Bull. Please, no Mr. Bull. Please, no Mr. Thank God. I got through without... Or shouldn't... Okay, got through without Mr. Bull. <laughs> Potato City. And now. Potato City! Potato City. Yeah, I kind of have heard that. To explore and have fun. But yeah, that's the same like a lot of the original games. It's like, you know, they perfect it once, and then it's, you know, it's, it's sequelitis. It's hard to top, you know, the first one. Hello and welcome to Potato City! Have you come to have fun? Yes, yes. Oh my gosh, yes, the jump and duck one was always so intense. Yes, yes. Oh, I love the sumo one though. I just love trying to like force everyone off. Vegetables at least five times a day. Um, yes. Fun. Sumo was always. You are going to oh, there was another one. I love the hammer one where you just like walked around and doing people with hammers. There are plenty of things to do and plenty of things to see. All right then, run along, children. Have fun. I love how that's a rare achievement because it's so convoluted. There is nothing hard about it. But now I have completed my friend Peppa Pig. Oh, thank God. Yeah, right. I don't know why I have a party. Uh, but, uh. I'll uh, I'll let you give I'll 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 let you know my rating right now of this game. It wasn't too bad until I just kind of got to that point like near the end, and then I just realized how archaic and confusing a lot of the stuff is in it. There we go. So yeah. Overall, not a bad game. You know what? On True Achievements, it's rated like two and a half stars out of five. That sounds about right. If I was a kid, I'd probably be having a lot of fun with it. As an adult, it's... Well, I mean, it's not made for me. But still, even as a kid, I'd be pretty confused with some of the things they set up. Alright, well... That's the stream. I actually completed it, thankfully. Alright, everyone. Have yourselves a lovely evening, and thank you for tuning in. And this should be going up on YouTube probably around Wednesday. And I'll also cut it down into, like, highlights, because I know not everyone has about, like, an hour or two to watch this entire run. But you can see all the achievements and all the other fun moments. All right? Have a lovely evening, everyone. Bye-bye.